and we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you how to create borders for videos that have rounded corners. You will find this footage via the description link below. I drag it into my timeline, right click on link and I delete the audio clip. 10 seconds are enough so I press C for the cut tool. Let me check the size of it on the sequence. And I guess I'll size it down to the typical YouTube video size, so 90, 20 times 1080. Now let me size it down. So go to 10%, double click on it, and I'll size it down. Let me go to fit, and I'll size it down a little bit further, but that's fine. Now use the roughen edges effect. So just type in roughen, and it should pop up. You'll find the effects and the effect controls panel on the window if you can't see them. Let's go to the effect controls for our footage. I go to rough and edges and I set the edge sharpness to 10 and the fractal influence should be 0. But let me scale it down a little bit more so that we can already see what I'm doing here. Uh, 45 is already a bit too big, so upwards 48 is fine in this case. So let me go back to the values. You can now increase the border, which sets the scale of it. You must set fractal influence to zero, because otherwise we've got this effect. And the edge sharpness, it gives it a little bit of a blur. So if you go down to one, you can already see it, but let me go to zero and it becomes obvious. So it blurs out. So set it to 10 and you can't really see this blur anymore. By default, the background in Premiere Pro is black, but if you don't want to have a black background, just go back to project menu, right click new item, color matte. It now has the same size as your sequence, so we can use that directly. Let me make it white. And I rename that to white and I press OK. It has to be below our footage, so drag the footage to video channel 2 and then the color map below. And this so we can make this background white. Sometimes it makes sense to use the color picker, so let me create a new color map. And now I click on the color picker icon and I select this greenish color from the original footage. Let me rename this to green. Place it below the footage. You can see that it takes Premiere Pro a little bit to actually render it. So if you play the footage, you might also see these sharp edges where we now have the round corners. Don't worry if you export your video, they will be round the entire time. So it's just a preview window here for Premiere Pro that does this. And this is the process that you can use to create these borders with rounded corners for videos in Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.